Hello gamers, first of all, I'm so sorry that I haven't been posting for the last two weeks, but it's for good reasons, it's good news. You might know that I'm trying to monetize everything that I'm doing around League of Legends, and I got actually hired by a team, an amateur team, to coach them and help them improve, which I did, and I spent a lot of time on it, plus I had some things going IRL. So now I'm back, and I'm gonna make up for the time that I have lost. So instead of posting one video and one short per day, I'm gonna post two, one every 12 hours for the next couple of weeks. So we come back to that average of one video a day for a full year. I promise that you will get that. So for this video, talking about just a simple concept, the fact that patience is so important in early game. And what I mean by patience, it's accepting small wins. Small win plus small win plus small win are gonna snowball into a big lead, big win condition for yourself. So sometimes when it's flippy, but you maybe have a dive etc and you're not exactly sure sometimes it's good to just take your base come back to a good wave state come back to a good advantage and snowball from that point so don't be scared to be patient good things will come hope you enjoyed the video thank you for being here much love i realized something guys by the way so I kind of shifted my mindset, I mean, I, I shifted my mindset like dozens of times regarding League because I think it evolves with you as a human as well. Um, like you as a player and you as a human is always a parallel and sometimes you're going to use League to be the opposite of what you are in life. Let's say like you're a really chill, really calm person and you gather a lot of negative emotions during the day and then you're going to lash out in League. And sometimes like the worst persons in video games are the best persons in life you know uh or you're gonna do like be aligned and do kind of the same thing and for me what happened is like some some time ago i was like all well, regarding emotions and tilt etc uh i would try to be a robot you know i would try to have zero emotions and and just like be consistent at trying to find the best play and trying to perform and whatever happens happens you know and i would try to consider that everyone is a bot etc and then recently then recently uh doing my performance coaching etc um i realized that emotions are important emotions do matter uh people are not bots and you should not consider that they are because they're gonna make mistakes that you can punish etc also, I realized that you have plenty of high elo or even maybe pro players that feel emotions, but then let them let them happen, you know. So they get mad, they get crazy, etc. But they still play the game. So I was more into that mindset. And then what happened is actually today I was going on potent stream, I think, and I was seeing potent get completely turbo mad at game on a Smurf account in very low masters and just being trouble focused like we're not gonna win this game get me out of that shit get me out we're not gonna win it what's the point etc and and he was complaining about the play that happened minute three for the next 24 minutes at minute 27 he was still talking about it and even next game he was still talking about it and then just right after that uh, i talked with gf and she was not feeling the best because i mean she has yeah she de she deals with the anxiety and stuff uh, like many women in the modern sword. Uh, anyway, I realized that... I mean, this is not what, I'm, what I want to be putting on the internet. This is not how I want to be doing activities, spending my time. So I would probably go back to a more robotic mindset. Um... Yeah, we actually we actually have a comment here. We used to have a rule that said uh, if I ever tilt and you make me notice that uh, I'm tilting, uh, you can say it. Like you make me notice that I'm tilting and I owe you a skin, favorable skin. Well, this is back, and. Basically, I, I, I will I would just take like, not tilt, and I will try to be driven towards performance. It also, encourage me uh, seeing potent like that because I was like, oh shit, I walked in that. I mean, I guess it makes him use fate rush, so it might not be the best, uh, the worst. Uh, 
I should have rescued. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Mm. It's very tempting, but... I guess I have a flash advantage. I should have probably went for the dive here. I should have kept my fury up and go for the dive. And then he's still in a bad spot. Like, I have a lead now when I can, I can actually like, slowly snowball that. I missed a ton of CS though. And also, I didn't know where Volley was. And if Volley was top, he was 100% covering the dive. Um... I mean, my only problem is Volibear still. A play happened, but... Yeah, I was gonna say. This is not gonna work. This fucks him so bad. It's so, so bad. Look at what Lilia is doing and look at what Vod is doing. I shouldn't have flashed. I was not in danger. I'm actually fine with them freezing. Or actually... Next CS I get level 6. It's a bit sad. That she get, gives a she gives a six hundred gold kill. Uh, at least it goes on Aatrox and not someone else. And get to crush my wave. So now I will have to deal with that. I don't know. I should have said that I was playing for level 6. Oh, so sad. Maybe she can catch up. Can I troll that? Enemy killing spree. I was thinking that I had boots advantage, but...
The good thing is hmm, that I have sustain. Can press some Qs. Yeah, it's really low in mana. trade a lot of HP the first one first Jengar who comes is gonna win it um okay pretty good let's pay this keep running faster than Aatrox Both Twitch and Zeri are scaling. They have they have a bit of a lead though. They have more plates. More everything. Yeah, we're being followed. Okay. I pressed tab and I saw that all he had was damage. Uh, he might have TP back up this time. No? Uh, it's so bad that this minion came all the way. And now the wave is pushing to him. Lucky. Oh, it's okay, it happened. We get Drake here. The shield killed the gay. Mm. Okay, Vody is actually still bot. I was concerned about Voli. I missed a chance to fight him. We can find that. I mean, this kind of helps fighting that. Missing a ton of CS. Hello, Mr. Mio. Yo. Should look streaming at a normal time for my time zone. Let's go. Let's go, Benny. Stanley is going to be pretty rare. Usually, my days end at 7 p.m. my time. And now it's 8. Yeah. But really happy that you're allowed to catch up this time. Nice to have you. Into battle. Yeah, 
Yeah, I kind of ate everything. Maybe waiting in that bush. Okay. Uh, when does he get face rush again? Bro, he already has it. Look. Well, then it was really bad. Okay, let's touch some cues. That's the problem of going full damage into Trent. I don't care about your damage for 5 seconds. But I can care about you being squishy. Okay, let's not risk giving a shutdown here. Yeah, we don't have mid prayer, we cannot just start it. As you okay, it's happening. Wait, what happened? I was not moving anymore. Uh, I don't like the fact that I have no ult. What's happening with my FPS? I'm losing so many frames. What the fuck? Okay. Get you one. Or solo in CS, both me and Aatrox. I can actually make a play with fast base. I don't think I'm diving a trucks anyway. So mate as well base and go Drake. Come. A truck spot uh, stop still. It's okay, we can go Drake, we can go Drake. We're most likely gonna have a really good soul. Okay, Hextech. Like that. Where does he come, but Thank you. Yeah, I think she understood. That... <laughs> I had two ghosts to, to catch up. Yeah, I think she quickly understood that her champ is really good into main, but I have too much damage right now. Uh, if my map is right, no one's coming yet. But they may be coming now. Yeah. Okay, I wouldn't end up having to sell this dagger. I really thought I would do something with this dagger. Unless, nope. Yeah, I kinda messed up. It's okay though. Doesn't cost us too much. Much. Meow meow. Okay, what do now? I mean I think I think we just play for that as a team. Should 
Shouldn't try to make anything crazy happen. Not, not a big fan of that play. Never mind. Never mind. If it works, it works, you know.